Okay, so I'm back with the Sublime series and my name is Sarthak and you are on the Bitfilms channel. It's time for the package installations. So firstly, I will go to preferences and you can see it says browse package, but it's package for on your PC. But if you want to download any package from your from the internet, then how will you do that? For that, you have to just press Ctrl, Shift and P and you have to search for package. Obviously, V does not have any package installed. So it's saying install package controller. So to install a, any package, you need a package controller. It says just like a, to, to download any package, you need a package. So firstly, we need a single package called package controller which controls every package so if you have fresh installation of sublime like me you don't ever have the package control installed so let's type here so I will repeat my steps so I will just press control shift and P and I will say here package and install package controller and I will hit enter and it's doing something and you can see now we are getting the message that package controller was successfully installed and use the command palette and type install package to get it started. So obviously for that you have to again press control shift and P but now this time you can see I have installed the package controller that's why it's having the list of package controller commands. So I want to install a new package so it says package control colon install package so obviously we, do, we don't have to write the whole thing so obviously I will do shift control shift and P and I will just say install and it's now here and I will press enter and the first sublime package I am going to show you is Emmet. And it's very awesome and you will obviously love this and obviously many of them many of you has requested me how will I do that things so here is I will show you that thing okay so it says loading repositories that means it's getting the list of the packages for the sublime and in the in that list you can now search so you can see we have that list here and it's a never ending i think it's having many many packages so obviously you don't have to just scroll down and look for each and every package you can just search on the search bar and i want emit so i will say emit and you can see emit is here so i will just install this so again as we have done i will just press enter so it says installing package emit so it's installing that package of emit and now you will get that message which says control package control message which says emit is successfully installed now it's time for create a new magic so now I will type 5 hit tab and nothing happened because we have to change it to plain text to HTML so here we are and hit tab and you can see we have that thing so what I have done I have nothing here and I am on a page of HTML so obviously if we have an unsaved tab unsaved page how will sublime know which language you are writing so you can change your language from here you can see it's having HTML, it's having CSS and many more PHP. So if you are writing a PHP, but here I want to show you Emmet. So I will just open HTML and I will say HTML colon 5 hit tab and everything is on here. So this is because of the Emmet. So let's say I want to create a div of container. So I will say div obviously with a bracket div and I will close this so now you can see when I hit slash it will always complete we don't have to type div again so you can see like this and for creating a container I will say class 
and now you can see it's giving me suggestions of class it says class as attribute okay class as attribute I will hit enter and you can see it's complete with the arrow and even I don't have to type whole class I will just say CL and you can see we have class just like this and you can type container and like this again I want to create a div so I will just type div and press tab and it always complete you don't have to just you don't have to just write this and like this no not at all you can say div tab complete and now for the class C and enter have you just seen it I have done C enter it's complete now row it's nice isn't it okay now what I am I want to do I don't want to write like this I want to do a magic so let's see I want to create a firstly having a div with a class of container so I will say container okay and after that inside the container I want another div having class of row so I will say dot row it's okay it's fine and inside that I will say I want a table so it's okay I want a table of class table so table dot table dot means class okay and inside that class what I want I want table head so t head and also inside that table head I want what table head that means th so I will say th and I want three of the th so into three it's okay I think it's fine but after that what I need I need one thing more one thing what I want to do I want to say I have a t body so I will say t body inside t H, but I don't want that to be inside th so what I will do I will say plus and I will make it inside a parenthesis so how will I make parenthesis so obviously I will have to do like this I think you are familiar with this but there is a cool way so what I have to do I have to just select this thing and now I just have to press shift and 9 and you can see it complete the parenthesis okay so now so what I have done here I have given a dot table inside table I want table head and inside table head I want th3 and now we have table body so I will cover it inside parenthesis so shift 9 parenthesis inside t body I want tr and inside tr I want td of 3 isn't it cool now it's done and I just have to press tab so I will press tab and you can see we have a magical thing we have told Emmet that I want to create a div of container a div of row table with a class of table table head and three table that means th and after table body one table row and table data all add just one line so I will just undo so you can see what I have done okay so I will just show you so what I will do I will just create it and now I will explain this so I have a dot container so oops it's dot container <laughs> oops so I have to do like this dot container and you can see this is the dot container inside dot container I have a row so for inside that means uh, this sign now dot row if you're not giving anything I mean assume it as a div but if you want something else some other element so you have to just type that name so inside row I have table of class table so I will say table dot table and inside table I have a t head and t body so like that 
I have to say firstly T head and plus T body. Okay, but in T head I want three T H. So inside T head I want to say T H into three, and I want inside a T body a single T R. So it says single T R, and in that T R I want T D three. So it will be T D into three. Let's suppose I want to say here uh, copy paste and paste. I want three T R. So how will I do that thing? So so for that I will do I will just grab this inside parenthesis and with that I will say three. And now let's see what happened. So what I will do I will give a space so that I can see. Now hit tab and you can see we have as identical thing. Okay. So this is the power of Sublime with the package Emmet. We will meet in the next time. Stay tuned to Bitfumes and don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Share these video with your developer friends so that everyone get the knowledge of everything. Laravel and Sublime also. And obviously I have many requests and I will complete each and every request very soon so please please wait for some time i have to complete many requests so i will complete each and every request one by one and we will meet in the next time so bye bye